Hi folks, the review fella here again. So occasional cleaning of your TV screen is essential to ensure that your viewing experience is as best as it possibly can be. Think about it, this is one if not the most expensive appliance in your house. So why wouldn't you want to take care of it? Cleaning might range from routine dust removal to more serious issues like the kids fingerprints or that beer you threw everywhere. Either way, if you don't keep your screen in tip top condition, your viewing pleasure will suffer and you may damage your screen. So today I'll tell you what the experts say about that. How the people who built your TV recommend you clean it. I'm going to look at LG, Samsung and Sony and I'll also tell you at the end what I do with mine. If we follow the manufacturer's guidelines and add a sprinkle of common sense we can be sure our warranty stays intact and we get the very best out of this expensive gadget. I'm not going to cover every manufacturer as most modern TV screens are made of the same material. Therefore one thing we must not do and all manufacturers will agree on this is use any kind of household surface or glass cleaner on a plastic screen. Also do not use any kind of paper based items like tissues or paper towels, including toilet paper. These could create micro scratches on your screen. Even if it looks like it might be doing the job, you're going to damage your screen over time and ruin things like the anti reflective layer. So let's start with one of the biggest TV manufacturers in the world, LG. LG don't really offer much advice at all, they say just use a lint free cloth. So this would be a microfiber cloth, which you should use in a circular motion. Microfiber cloths are cheap and you can get them from Amazon or your local store. They're all pretty much the same. LG also say not to use any chemicals and don't spray water directly onto your screen. If it's really dirty they suggest ask the community. Not a great help. I wouldn't imagine anyone in the community is going to come round and clean your TV unless you pay them. Samsung on the other hand do offer more advice. Again no kind of chemical or glass cleaner here, just use a clean microfiber cloth for the screen and body. A small amount of water can be used on the screen, this should not be sprayed directly onto the TV but onto the cloth itself, then dried with a different dry microfiber cloth. Now on to Sony who give the most comprehensive TV cleaning guidance. Once again no chemicals or glass cleaner, this is common to most TV manufacturers. They mention a soft cloth like an eyeglass cleaner. A cloth like this would be too small I think, so I'd recommend a microfiber cloth again here. Sony say you can use a tiny amount of non-soap cleaner for very difficult marks, as long as it's diluted in water, and as long as it's dried off straight away. So that is what the three main TV manufacturers I reached out to recommended. And here's what I do. For regular dust removal I gently wipe the screen, body and stand of the TV with a clean and dry microfiber cloth, being careful not to apply too much pressure to the screen itself. For more stubborn marks on the screen I'll gently wipe in a circular motion, again not applying very much pressure. Pressure could damage the screen. Smudges, finger marks and mysterious sticky stuff I'll use one of two approaches. A small amount of distilled water sprayed onto a microfiber cloth. Distilled water is better than tap water for your screen. Gently wipe marks away and dry with a different microfiber cloth. Really that's the most I ever do, it works for just about any stubborn mark. For marks that just won't shift, these might be oil based stains or such like, a tiny amount of a non soap cleaner or a single drop of washing up liquid heavily diluted in distilled water, then sprayed onto the cloth, not directly onto the screen. Clean the screen gently, then dry using a second dry cloth. And that's about it folks, the advice of the three largest TV manufacturers together with how I do it myself. Itself. Needless to say no water should enter the TV and if I ever use a slightly damp cloth on the screen the TV is always unplugged and the screen and my hands are dried thoroughly before turning it back on. Also make sure you consult your TV manufacturer's guidelines if you're going to do any more than just wipe the dust with a dry cloth. I hope you found that useful. If it was then please consider a thumbs up, it's a big help to my small channel if you do that for me please. For more tech reviews and how to videos please consider subscribing. Check out the links in the description if you'd like to see a list of of my gear, including my TV and the gear I use to make YouTube videos. Thank you once again, please stay safe and I very much hope to see you soon.